I'm so excited about having the opportunity to talk with you today, but most importantly, to introduce you to the people that are going to be watching this video. And part of my excitement is because I believe that you just typify the dream of, of every person, which is to latch on to an idea and get it, have it be so big you can't let go and experience all of the wonderful rewards as a result of it. So would you mind starting out just introducing yourself and telling us a little bit about yourself and how you happen to come to this point where we're having this conversation? Absolutely, James. We are so honored to be um, on this call with you today and we're extremely excited. We absolutely love sharing um, how we have been able to make our dreams come true in so many so many other people in such a short space of time. And just to give you a little bit of a background into ourselves, we're two very ordinary people, but we get to live a pretty extraordinary life, we believe now. And I am a mum of two. My name is Mary, as you said, and our kids are age six and four now. And I used to actually be a secondary school teacher. Mm -hmm. I taught kids between 12 and 18 years of age. Um, and I love my job. It was extremely challenging. It was extremely rewarding. But it wasn't it it wasn't what I dreamed that I wanted to be when I was younger. So, um, what about yourself? Yeah, myself. Um, my name's Seamus Penrose, so Mary's better half. <laughs> I I was a carpenter, so I left school when I was young because going to college just wasn't really something for me at that time. So I went into the construction industry, but I was always really entrepreneurial and didn't really like the idea of working for other people. So I decided after a while I kind of saved all the money I could and I decided to kind of go out on my own. So I set up my own stair business, which was going really well until recession hit Ireland 2008. And I actually started getting more and more into debt trying to keep my business afloat. So I actually realized that I was actually working more hours for less pay, so spending more time away from my family. So I decided to pack it in and I went back to college and I did a honors degree in computer programming and I just finished it there last year. And part of this, uh, the process, you mentioned, you know, you have, you have children, you have two children now. And I think it was, from what I can recall, the birth of your daughter that you uh, had a major change in your life. Is that right, Mary? Absolutely, James. So it, it only started actually about four years ago, or will be four years in business on the 4th of May this year. Um, and it was when, when I had Abby, I had quite a difficult pregnancy with her. And I was looking for something that would basically make me feel better, increase my energy levels, bring me back to myself. We were at a stage in our life where we didn't have a great social life. Um, our Friday and Saturday evenings were, sent, were spent in front of the fire watching a movie. We were extremely happy, but at the same time, we would have liked the opportunity, the opportunity to maybe go away for a weekend, go out for dinner. But we were just a young couple, and um, like most people nowadays, and excess money just wasn't wasn't there. So I was looking for a product that was going to make me feel better, but unfortunately, we actually didn't have the finances to afford it because every penny that we had was accounted for purely because we'd made the decision that Seamus, as he, as he mentioned, was going back to college. But I came across a product which really excited me and I'm actually not one of these people. A lot of women, when they see the latest thing, they get very excited and they want to have it. I'm actually not like that. So Seamus knew when I started talking about it that it must be good because I, didn't, I wouldn't just waste money on anything. Um, and there was something that just really attracted me to it, James. I love the idea that it was natural. I love the idea that if you were pregnant, you could take it. But more so, I love the idea that I could give it to Jamie, our two-year-old. So I started taking a product, never dreaming what lay ahead. And little did I know how it was going to change our lives. First and foremost, it improved my health no end. I felt fantastic. I came back to myself. My energy levels were really, really great. Um, I physically looked really good. I looked really healthy. Um, and then out of nowhere came the opportunity to sign up our own, start up our own franchise and to basically share this amazing product that we had found with lots of other people. Um, Seamus was a very was very skeptical to put it slightly at the start because it was very it was so different to anything we'd ever done before. Um, but after a little bit of yeah, bit of, it just it took me a long time coming from a traditional business. It took me a long time to get my head around network marketing because I was used to 
buying in materials, making something, and then selling it on with the, with the idea that I didn't actually have to buy in stuff and I didn't have to try and sell it on to people. And I didn't have to go around looking for the money because that was the p biggest part that I hated about my business. I used to love actually making stairs stuff, but I was actually going and trying to get the money off people and people maybe didn't have the money maybe to pay it. And that used to really, it was one of the biggest parts that I hated about my business. But that, with the Juice Plus business, I really love the idea that we didn't actually have to go and do it and what kind of got me excited. Yeah, so it's been an absolute whirlwind, James, to be honest. Um, it started out as a, as a hobby. It was, it was going to be our plan B. It was a way of supplementing um, our family income. I didn't have any confidence in myself. Being a teacher, people find that hard to believe, but I, I didn't. I wasn't a very social person. I love being around people, but I was, I was quite shy. Um, and I, I just thought, okay, this is great. I know this product is amazing. I know people should be taking it, and I know they genuinely will be will thank me for it when they've been on it for a while. And that's where it started. But the the, the opportunity in the company actually reignited dreams in us that we had forgotten about. And what it made us realize is that too often than not, we have so many dreams growing up as children. I mean, we listen to our kids nowadays, and every night they want to be something different every morning they wake up. And they want to they want to travel the world and most people are like that but they let life get in the way and we we give up too easily but life doesn't have to be like that there's the most amazing opportunities out there and <laughs> i am so grateful that we find one that makes us dream bigger than we've ever thought possible now one of the things that has happened is based on your enthusiasm and introducing me to about 60 of the people that you're working with in ireland uh, when I did a seminar there, uh, maybe two or three weeks ago, you have an amazing enthusiasm because the products are so good. Yeah. But in addition to that, it's not just a question of the products. They also have a process where people like yourselves can actually start their own business on a part-time basis. Is that the way that you started? How did, how, would you mind just sharing with it how, how that happened? Yeah, well, as Mary said, Mary was take, started taking the product and she has fantastic benefits and she was automatically sharing it with her friends. All her friends were asking, what are you doing? You've, you've so much energy, you're just after having a baby. And she was telling them about just posting the product and everybody was really interested and people wanted to buy the product. So we started seeing that there was actually a real business opportunity there. So we decided to sign up to the franchise and it was brilliant because at it was like all the benefits of a traditional franchise, but there was very low startup costs. And it was a real, you could build it up that you could get residual income. With my stair business, when I didn't actually work, I didn't get paid. But with just us, after a while, it allowed us to build up some residual income so we could take a couple of days out. But we still got paid for it, which was brilliant. Yeah, and at the start, James, you must remember that we had no experience in this type of business. Seamus, yes, he had run a traditional type of business in, in construction. I was a teacher. So the idea of getting involved in, you know, building a network and helping other people earn an income by sharing that this amazing product with lots of other people was so alien to us. But we just embraced it. And there really was no particular system when we started. But over the past four years, we have fine-tuned it to perfection that when somebody joins us, <laughs> we're able to guarantee them success if they if they listen if they're coachable if they're, they have a burning desire to achieve more and if they have a good work ethic then we can show them exactly how they can not only transform their life but lots of others how exciting and i i know that uh, the experience the success that you've experienced where you were named entrepreneur of the year in 2015 but in addition to that, you are the leading distributor of this uh, amazing food supplement uh, in Ireland. And so that being the case, you've taken something where it was a very, you started very small, but now it's grown to a very substantial business. And so the reason I wanted everybody to meet you is because everybody needs a picture on the wall, somebody to look to and say, I want to be like that, that person or th those that couple and in your particular case you have you are the ideal and you can be the picture on the wall for many many people so what i would like to say is as a result of our uh meeting one another uh, uh the next step is you had a you had a great product you had 
uh, the process in place, but you came to me and we came to meet one another through your interest in IMA and the idea of helping people um, understand, relate to, and work with people better. And so you're using IMA now with your network uh, to be able to help, to help them. And could you tell me how is it benefiting you? Well, I suppose with us, with our, with our business model, you really, the strength of your, the success of your business is based on how well you can get to know, like, trust and build relationships with people. Um, and the only reason that we have been as successful as, as we have been is that we have the most amazing team of people that we work with on a daily basis. But I, I firmly believe that you can always improve every day. And it was Seamus actually um, was very much attracted to Ima because he's seen a huge opportunity for us to take our business to the next level. Yeah, I thought, as Mary said, our business is all about people. It's a real people's business. If you can't understand or work with people, it's going to be very difficult to actually be successful in the business. When I went to a seminar and I heard Patrick O'Malley talking about AIMA and I just something clicked with me, a light bulb went off and I thought this is a perfect fit for our business because our business is all around people and so is AIMA. AIMA helps you understand people so the two of them fit it together perfectly. And what our business, we couldn't really work any harder because we were doing so much work. So what AIMA has actually allowed us to do is actually work smarter. So the amount of people that we're actually talking to, we're getting far more conversion rates. We're helping them be far more productive. It's even helping ourselves be far more productive. The biggest, the biggest disappointment to me when I go to bed at night is if I haven't been able to really fully explain to somebody what an unbelievable opportunity this is. And through implementing AIMA over the past month, we have had our most successful month to date. So that makes me extremely happy because I know that I am going to be able to really help these people develop, you know, an extra income, help a lot of people get healthier purely because I understand how they work better and how they are going to be able to optimize their own personality to, to reach their, to reach, to make their dreams come true. Well, this is what dream weaving is all about, isn't it? It's the idea uh, to identify and dare to dream a big dream to move in its direction and actualizing it by connecting other people's dreams with your dream and helping everybody get what they want. And you are the perfect example of what being a dream weaver is all about. I've really enjoyed the opportunity to uh, talk with you today, also to be working with you because you are now IMA practitioners, you're using it within your network, we're going to be doing some dream weaving seminars that everybody's involved, invited to attend. And so I'd like to just say thank you very much for giving me the opportunity to share your very powerful message with the world. All the best. Thank you again. Thank you so much, James. Thank you, everyone. Bye. Bye. Bye.